up y'all it's your girl Jessica Marie and welcome back to my channel so in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys my simple morning skincare routine this is great for beginners people who really don't know exactly what to do um, everything that you can find at Target Walmart or your local uh, drugstore and um, this is for all skin types but pretty much um, detail for anyone who has combination skin. So I'm going to quit talking and if you guys want to see what I do, let's get right into the video. All right, y'all. So first step is making sure that you pick a good cleanser that is gentle and also um, sulfate free. So this will remove any impurities from your skin as well as prep it for the rest of your routine. I'm using the CeraVe Acne Control Cleanser. This is new and it has 2% salicylic acid treatment. So this honestly just helps control any breakouts from happening as well as improving the look um, of the pores. I do have some pores in my forehead as well as my cheeks. The reason why I like this is because it definitely does have um, the oil absorbing ingredients which are niacinamide, ceramides, and hectoric clay. I believe that this is really good for people with sensitive skin as well as combination skin because it's not going to dry out the rest of your face. So if your face is normal on the outside, but you have a T-zone like me, it's not going to bother you at all or strip your skin. Next, I'm going to take a washcloth and I am going to go ahead and drench it with some hot water. This is actually one of my very first um, and favorite steps that I like to do. Typically you can use a steamer. That definitely helps open up the pores and get the product into your skin but I end up doing mine away so I'm just going to use this instead and if you actually notice they actually do this when they're doing your facials. So if you don't have one, definitely go ahead and use this step. It's really, really comfortable and nice and relaxing. And it feels really good. So now I'm just removing all the cleanser from my face. As you can see. And my face right now, it doesn't feel dry. It doesn't feel stripped. It actually feels really um, balanced. So I really like that. And I'll make sure to link everything that I use in the description box. Next, I'm going to go ahead and use these eye patches. I really like eye patches because it helps with um, puffiness. It helps with it, any like wrinkles you may have. And it's also cute, you know? It kind of gives that self-care. I'm just placing it on my face. Next, I am going in with one of my favorite masks. So this one is the Pixie Rose Remedy Mask and it's a nourishing toning jelly. And what I like about it, it actually has a spoon on the side of it. You can get this from Target or Ulta. And this is actually a jelly gel type of consistency. So I'm going to go ahead and apply it with my spoon all over my face and it's supposed to replenish as well as even out your skin. It nourishes it, it hydrates it and um, with the rose remedy this has argan oil, turmeric and roses so it just makes it feel really really good and just put all the good this back into your skin especially hydration and those who um are combination skin like me don't be afraid to use hydrating you definitely want to use things to hydrate your face it's very important you can also use this in the morning or at night but i typically use this in the morning
And one of the things too that I like about it is like pouring. It feels really, really good. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and use my hands and I am going to massage the mask all over my skin. And then you're going to leave this for 10 minutes. All right, after the 10 minutes up, now I'm going to go ahead and I'm taking my eye patches off. And then I'm going to go ahead and glue the mask with another washcloth. This one, you can rinse it out with your face, but I feel like it's so the texture is just too. I don't want to say slimy because of the jelly, but for me, it's just a lot easier using and removing it with a wash rag. Please excuse my eyebrows, y'all. Like, whew, they need that. I'm not going through it right now, so here we go. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and pat dry my face. Don't rub or anything like that because you don't wanna irritate your skin. Just pat dry your face. And then I'm gonna go in with one of my favorite toners and it's also by Pixie. And this one is Glow Tonic and um, it's an exfoliating toner. So it has 5% of glycolic acid which is the exfoliating ingredient. And I'm just gonna go ahead and use a cotton pad and then put it all over my face. So if you guys know the OG Jackie Ina, she actually puts hers in the ice cube trays <laughs> and she puts it all over her face um, once they're in like frozen form. You can also do that as well. It's kind of cool. But. And this is also alcohol free. So it doesn't like ding or anything like that. But the glow tonic um, also brightens your face. So that's how you get that healthy glowing skin. And you can also use this in the morning or at night. And then how many of you guys know all about the snail mucin? I honestly just got hip to it not too long ago. And I really, really, really love this stuff. You can also find this at Alta. And this also has the glycolic acid, which helps brighten and improve your skin. And it's hydrating as well. So it improves your skin tone and also reverses and reduces signs of aging. So I like that. And you guys can see, like, my skin is already starting to glow. Y'all see the, the specs? All right, so now I'm gonna go with my L'Oreal Collagen Moisturizing Moisturizer. And I just honestly pat it on my face rather than like rub it. I just like to apply it that way. It's glowing, hydrating. And my skin feels great. Doesn't feel out, doesn't feel stripped. I'm just showing you the up close. And then my final step is, of course, making sure we moisturize the lips. So I am using the Big Little Brand by Bath and Body Works, and it's the Vanilla Mint. I really like it. And 
that's my skincare routine y'all all right y'all so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video please don't forget to thumbs up this video if you like it as well as subscribe to my channel for more videos like this please comment below and let me know the type of products that you guys use or if there's anything in particular that you would like me to try or um use so i hope you guys have a good one and i will see you guys in the next video bye